Hey guys, what's up? It's Nick at the Lost River Drive-In and I'm coming at you today to do something that I did about a month ago and it had really good reception to it. So I felt like it was something maybe you guys would want to see again, something similar. So we're going to do a little like vlog video today, a day in the life of me. I am outside Walmart right now. We're going to go in there and we're going to try to see if we can't find some horror films to pick up. And then we're going to head on over to Target and we're going to see if we can't find some horror films to pick up. So a little impromptu shopping trip. Should be exciting. Should be exhilarating. Buckle your seatbelts. We get nasty. Let's do it. Psycho 4K, 1996. Willie's <laughs> Wonderland. Sun, Andy Matichak. Massive pile of movies in your $5 bin. Five bucks for the Meg on DVD is not bad, but I want the Blu-ray, that's the problem. Child play. Don't breathe. However, I will say, Candyman DVD in here as well. When I was on vacation earlier this week, I was at a Walmart and they had it and I bought it on DVD because it was five bucks. Purge movies in here. Um, there you go, Twihards. Crawl. We've seen this one all over the place. Annabelle comes home. And this, all I can think about is Stewie freaking out about this on Family Guy every time. This is sick. Godzilla strategy sick. game. Tokyo Clash. Sick. sick. Sick, yeah, I know. I think so too. It's not that I don't watch DVDs anymore, because I do, but it's if I can get the same sets of these movies on Blu-ray for not much more, there's no point in owning both. You know I'll literally take both right now. I like this little sign. Oh, the Halloween hat's gone. These are sexual, dude. <laughs> it's like Japanese. Shocker, every Halloween edition they have, I own. They no longer have the Blu-ray of Hereditary. Oh, I don't have this on Blu-ray. Oh, yes. Picking this up, seven bucks. This movie's incredible. Oh my God. It's a real, that's real. Well, we went horror hunting and we're back. What did we end up with? Well, first and foremost, I picked this up at Walmart and just cause it was in the $5 bin and I felt like that was, I felt like I could not let this walk away. I didn't own the DVD edition of it, so I got it. And that is just Candyman, Candyman. I love this movie. You guys know I'm really excited for the new one. This is like completely bare bones. There is not a single special feature on here. No disc art. It's in the $5 bin. I don't own this edition. So I said, why not? 
Let's pick up the Randy Man. I posted this on Instagram the other day when I got it. These trips were over multiple days. This wasn't just one day. And I haven't seen it, but I trust the director. I really like his work and I've heard good things about it. And that is Freaky. This is the um, Vince Vaughn Freaky Friday type uh, slasher comedy. Christopher Landon uh, directed Happy Death Day and Happy Death Day to You. I really like both of those movies. Anxiously awaiting watching this one. May watch it tonight, may not, not sure. Got a digital code for y'all. This is a newer movie too, so I'm sure there's a lot of people that haven't seen this movie that maybe wanna watch it. So whoever wants the code, there you go. And that's what you get from Christopher Landon. You know, Happy Death Day and Happy Death Day to You are both super fun movies. So let's dig in this goodie bag and see what else we got. Well, first of all, I saw this at the checkout and I just had to get it. No, I'm not gonna like keep it in here. I'm, I'll probably keep the wrapping, maybe, maybe, but dark chocolate Jaws bar. I don't know. I just thought it looked really cool. And I was like, ah, I gotta get it. So I bought it for $5. They did not have the Blu-ray. You guys know, I don't pick up a lot of DVDs. I really don't. I try to make a conscious effort not to if I'm able to find the Blu-ray. I can find the Blu-ray online, but this was five bucks. It was there. I bought it. The Maniac remake with Elijah Wood. Open it up and see what we got in here. This, uh, Justin has talked about this movie. We've talked about this movie together on streams before. Really, really looking forward to this movie. I really don't know if I've seen it. I'm being totally honest with you. I mean, if I have, it's been a really long time. So I'm definitely excited for it. I'm sure I'll watch it and uh, I'll be reminded. Oh, wow, that's cool. It's got reversible art in here. Let's check out this alternate. Oh, that's gnarly. There are some special features on here, a making of, a commentary with Elijah Wood and the director, Frank Calfoon. Deleted scenes, poster gallery, trailer. Yeah, really excited to delve back into this one. Five bucks, can't really go wrong. Even if it's, you know, it's a DVD, whatever, it's five bucks. Now this one I was super excited to pick up and I actually would have missed it had I not been such a nerd when it comes to these places and, you know, flip through all these movies and that is The House of the Devil. Blu-ray for $6.99. New, yeah, new. I love this movie. This is my favorite Ty West movie. I really did, I, you guys know I like The Innkeepers. And the funny thing is about a month ago when I was at FYE, I found The Innkeepers on Blu-ray for like seven bucks. And it just reignited for me like, oh, the, you know, the, the desire to find the Blu-ray for House of the Devil. When I was there, it, it wasn't on my mind, you know, like I just came across it and bought it. I'm, you know, very old school type of uh, slow burn horror movie that I just really dig. You get that a lot with The Innkeepers as well. Special features on here, you've got a commentary with Ty West and Jocelyn Donahue, another commentary with Ty West and the producers and crew, behind the scenes, deleted scenes, interviews, and the trailer. So some pretty good special features on here. Yeah, the ending of this movie threw me for a loop. Really, really enjoyed this. And the last thing I picked up at FYE, and can't even tell you why I didn't own it already, um, I have other editions of the movie, but I don't have this one. And I just was like, screw it, I'm buying it. And that is the 40th anniversary steelbook for the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Y'all know I like my steelbooks. Nice and sturdy. Four commentaries on here. One with Toby Hooper, Gunnar Hansen, and Daniel Pearl. One with Marilyn Burns, Alan Danzinger, Paul Partain, and Robert Burns. Another one with just Toby Hooper. Another one with Daniel Pearl, Larry Carroll, and Ted Nicolau. I just really, really dig this. Super cool. You're the only bummer. Wow, that's kind of a bummer. There's no art on the inside. A lot of these steelbooks have really cool art in the back here. None on here. It's a little bit of a bummer. But it's a beautiful steelbook. Very glad to now finally own it. So yeah, guys, that's the stuff I picked up on my little trip to Walmart, FYE, and Target. Target was a total bust. I was in there maybe five minutes. Their, their selection was pretty bad. Walmart, almost a total bust, but I ended up with Candyman. And then the rest, of course, FYE. So these are the new pickups. What do you guys think of these movies? Do you like them? Do you like these additions? Let me know in the comments below. I will be having a video coming very shortly of some new Halloween items that are slowly trickling in in the mail. So be on the lookout for that. So yeah, this is Nigga the Lost River Driving, pulling out.